Hello again, and welcome back to the card mat. Right, very nice cheeky little transpo trick, but it's also a nice confidence builder for you to do at the start of um, a gig or as an icebreaker, something like that, while people are still not sure exactly what they're going to see. Right, you can start off, you can give the packet a shuffle. <gasps> oh, and then you expect it to pick any card that they'd like. So, see that one there. They can look at their card. They can sign their card. It doesn't matter. You get their card and they see it going on top of the packet. Then you break off the top half of the packet and give it to them. And you go, right, now you've got your six of diamonds there. I need a card. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that one there. I'll take half the value on a different colour. I'll take the three of spades. Right, so I've got the three of spades. Right, now, both at the same time, you deal your six down and I'll deal my three down. So... Both at the same time, we deal the cards down. Obviously, I couldn't do them both at the same time. Both at the same time, because I've only got one pair of hands. Right, so I've got my three of spades, you've got your six of diamonds. If I go click and click, I end up with your six of diamonds, and you end up with my three of spades. And straight away there, wow, 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 like that straight away. And that's only your opening trick. I'd say you get away with it. If you've got the confidence, and you've got the gonads to do it, you get away with it. Dead easy. Note the bottom card. Shuffle the bottom card up to the top. Right, so I got two of hearts on the top. And remember, two of hearts. Get spectator to pick any card that they like. That one there. All the time, you're remembering two of hearts. They get their card. If you want to, you can let them sign it. More of an impact. They sign it. They see it going clearly on top of the packet. Then, you break off about half of the packet. Make sure your fingers are covering the front. And your thumbs in the back. Break off about half the packet and put your hand down like that in front of them. So they can't see the packet going down. But what you're going to be doing is breaking it off and wrist killing. Right? Make sure you don't have it like that so they can see a corner. You're going to wrist kill that hand. Right? Wrist kill that hand. Drop everything except for that top card. Then you just pull your two hands together and all you're doing is transferring that top card onto here. So blatant. So blatant. But they're not going to be noticing too much of what's going on and you'll get away with it. As long as your moves are smooth and you draw no attention to it. Now, um, I forgot what card I was using. Two of hearts. You now say you're going to look for a card. And it doesn't matter what card you take. You go, I'll, I'll, I'll take the two of hearts. And just transfer that to the top of the packet without them seeing. Right. Now all you need to know is how to do a second deal. So you say both at the same time. We'll deal our top cards down. This way they're not being in your hands because they're dealing a the card as well. So all you're then going to do is just turn your hand a little bit and just whip out your second deal. So you're putting their card on the table as they're putting your card on the table. But they think they've put their card on the table and you've put yours on the table. Then you can do your little magic anything you want to and go, right, well, I end up with your card and you end up with my card. And I say they'll all be going, wow, how the hell, you know, yeah, that wasn't and now it is. But, how'd, yeah, one of them, it's one of them with it, magic gone and then you can get on with the rest of whatever you were doing magic isn't it yeah magic um right yeah oh if any of you have got any questions anything you'd like to see or me to talk about <gasps> leave it in a comment and i'll see what i can do thank you very much for watching i hope you've enjoyed it hope you can get away with it you will do if you're confident and you're smooth and you don't draw no attention to what's going on I'll see you again soon.